Hey everybody, J-Rad here. Well, there's a new addition to the family. It's a 2005 YFZ 450. She was in pretty rough shape when I got her. Uh, did a couple things. She's good to go now though. And yeah, she's fun. But, uh, on a side note, it is 22 degrees out snowy icy gross um, I had a couple questions about my garage area um, so I figured I'd explain a couple things uh, this is a carport that I bought off amazon.com for about a hundred dollars um, I don't remember the name of it it's like something sports or something like that and it's just a cheap, generic, you know, flimsy little thing. Well, winter came, and I still have tools out here, and, you know, it's also our um, storage area, which, you know, we got rid of our storage unit, so it's kind of helping out with that. Um, but what I did to this, uh, this, uh, canopy was I added rafters to it I don't know if you can see it there's the original white rafter and there's the new rafter that I put in uh, it's basically half inch uh, electrical conduit I bought at uh, Lowe's it was like 235 uh, for a 10 foot length and so yeah it Works out pretty good. I, I ended up buying some conduit clamps for an inch and a quarter and I was able to bend them around and get this like, you know, clamp out of it. Um, working for an awning company has really helped me with this whole situation because otherwise I wouldn't have these sides, you know. The canopy, you can buy sides for it for another $50, but, um, but yeah, it it's working so far. We've had about two inches of snow and it's handling it I also added all these these lacings uh, it originally had those bungee cord things and when the snow fell on it it just stretched them out because they're bungee cords so that was a no good situation so I I laced it up with a uh, some some rope so it's nice and tight and these extra rafters I mean look at the spacing here if you can see that that's a that's a 10 foot space from down the end there to over here and I split it I'm getting about three foot four spacing now which in awning terms is not that great but you know I didn't really want to spend too much too much more money I also added these makeshift posts that kind of hold up the front pipes so those work out good too but yeah it, it's basically just a cheap carport you know it's not made to handle snow and hopefully I got it to handle snow and I have all these donated awning materials that I use for sides and yeah that's basically how my shop works sorry I haven't made a video in a while I've been, been really 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 busy uh, it's that time of year for the work that I'm doing and I'm just swamped. I've been working six days a week, you know, at least eight to ten hours a day. Um, Sunday is my only day off to spend with my family, and yeah, it's just been really hard to go out and make a video. And now it's so cold, I don't even want to. It's. I took a ride on this today, and my fingers were frozen within five minutes. And I have snowmobile gloves. I have really bad circulation in my hands, uh, so I got to figure that out. You know, I need, definitely need some warmer gear to go riding, uh, at least off-road anyway. I'm never going riding on-road in this kind of weather. But there's an old blaster frame. I brought it in here because I needed the uh, bushings out of it for the YFC. It worked out pretty good. But yeah, yeah, this is another thing I added. See these, uh, they're actually trees. <laughs> it's a tree. I brought it up to the peak to hold the peak up, give it some more stability. I got another one over there. So it's basically like my little garage. It, it's, it's working out pretty good. 
I'm hoping this, it can handle the snow. Um, we'll see how it goes. If it doesn't, it doesn't. It collapses, oh well. I didn't spend that much money on it. So, nothing should, should get ruined. As long as I keep up on it, we should be good. But, I hope everybody's doing alright. I'm hoping I can get some videos out uh, come January. And, you know, maybe if it warms up a little bit, I can take a ride on this thing. Do a little video on this. Maybe I'm, I'm actually thinking about studding my rear, my tires for my uh, for Onyxia. I might actually take her out for a spin in the snow. We'll see what happens. Uh, like I said, one day at a time. So, I hope you all enjoy your holiday. And I'll talk to you soon. J-Rad out.